Also in Virginia Beach, the trial is underway for a man accused of killing a teen in a very public place. And Darian McGinnis faces murder and robbery charges in the death of Bryant Cueto. Police say McGinnis and another man shot and killed Cueto in the parking lot of the Applebee's on General Booth Boulevard last May. Testimony began in the case this afternoon. And our Jason Marks has more details on what may have led up to the shooting, Jason. And Tom, prosecutors say this started as a drug deal. The victim was about to sell Xanax when he was shot and killed. May 1st, 2016. 18 year old Brian Cueto and a friend were at the Applebee's on Dam Neck Road. Prosecutors say they were there selling Xanax. Cueto, who was a Grassfield High School student in Chesapeake, was shot and killed. Police arrested two teenagers shortly after Jaquan Wilson and this man, Adarian McGinnis, who's now on trial. He's facing robbery and murder charges. Officers testified that after the shooting, Cueto's friend called dispatch and told him that his friend was shot and he was headed to the hospital. One officers caught up with the silver car. They found Cueto in the passenger seat, his shirt soaked in blood. They say he was shot in the back of his shoulder. Doctors weren't able to save his life. Officers say they talked with Cueto's friend, who told them the suspects got into the car, and as soon as Bryant pulled out the Xanax, someone fired. The most emotional testimony of the day came from Cueto's grandfather, Alberto Cueto. He said the last time he saw his grandson was the day he died. He sobbed when he talked about the moment when police showed up to his Chesapeake home and told him that Bryant had been killed. McGinnis was originally charged with second degree murder, but that was upgraded to first degree. He pleaded not guilty to all the charges he's facing. And prosecutors got about three fourths the way through their testimony in their case today. I'm told that the, this, the uh, testimony in the case will start first thing tomorrow morning. And this could last all the way into Thursday. That's the latest here in Virginia Beach. Jason Marks, 10 on your side.